Hello, it is Fishbow Geek and I am back today with Persephone Hawk. We are going to find something to um, hit and murder in order to cheer her up after uh, the tragic circumstances of losing her mother. Now, first of all, Aveline's here. Did you ever run the wilds, boy? Kirkwall is no city for a breed used to open spaces. Nice as your estate is, it's not healthy for a Mabari to be cooped up. May I take him to the barracks time to time? He could help train my guards. Good idea. He'll put the fear of dog into them. Good. I think it's time they face down a good old Mabari charge. How about it, boy? Wanna chew on some recruits? <laughs> <laughs> He's not gonna say no to that, is he? Bless him. Um, it's a bit disconcerting that that'll happen, uh, just at, oh, stores, I'll keep the, um, a Mel shield in there. Nope, that's the wrong button. Yes, let's, uh, let's stash that. We'll keep everything else just to ar arm people up with. Uh, right. Yeah, obviously she didn't come here, because I think we've got to go and visit her for her to say something about our mother dying, so it's a bit disconcerting that they'll, they'll have it timed. If there's anything I can do. Oh, bless you. I'm sure Orana has something nice to say as well. Um, so yeah, it's a bit weird. So, right. I want to figure out, I'm, I've made it my active quest, but it's sketchy on the details where there's assassins after somebody called Sketch. I want to see if we can figure that out. Yes, I know, but I'm not doing that because that's more main mission stuff after just doing that. So. Yeah, inside job. Um, hmm. That's going to talk to Hubert. Sketchy on the details. I'm just not sure. I might have to do a, a quick troll of going through everything and exploring everything, but I mean, that was honestly seems tedious. And eventually uncover more assassins that are after Sketch. I, I do think that group on the docks that we saw at night is almost certainly one of them. Um, although we didn't engage them last time, so I wonder how many we have to kill before engaging them. But uh, yeah, let's go see if we can't find uh, Hubert, who should be in his normal position down here. All right, you're just scrounging for money. Okay, so before we talk to him, I'm going to uh, do a bit of buying and selling and inventory stuff because I haven't done that yet. So, um, yeah, so let's do that. All right, bunch of money spent later. Let's get to it. Hubert, what have you got for me? You got my letter. You've been gone a while. I thought you had things under control. I told you I would handle this, and I did. Now, after a year of raids on our shipments, I finally caught one of the culprits. One of our miners, Sabine, has been leaking information. Do you know him? He claims to be from your hometown in Ferelden. I would like you to get this festering sore to divulge who is behind the theft. When you are ready, I will bring Sabine to you. Who is this man? I would not expect you to recall every piss pot from your past. That's the problem with being a big fish in a small pond. I could never tell the little fish apart. Well, Ooh, he um, brags to his fellows I've that he got an unspeakably arrogant over the years, haven't I? Bring Sabine back to my place. Excellent idea. I will get him now. I guess it's a good thing Mother isn't isn't home anymore. I don't think she would have uh, stood for the light torture that I expect is about to happen. Here is the 
dung pile I caught leaking next week's shipment schedule. He won't tell me who he's working with. Who else has been screwing <clears throat> me over? Tell me, you ratting mongrel! He can't talk with a mouthful of broken teeth. Please, Miss Hare, help me. I knew you since you was young and loathering. I knew your mum's family and your pop. Mike, you got him, Rick. Pathetic. <laughs> I leave this bastard in your capable hands. Get me when he's ready to talk. Thank you, Miss Hare. Us loathering folks should stick together. What made you betray your employer? Before the blight, my family had a good life in Lothering. Clean home, fertile land, friends. And Kirk, well, we lived in a hovel. People spit on us. And some days, we went hungry. Trust me, things could be worse. Tell me how to stop the next ambush. As soon as I tell Hubert what he wants to know, he'll kill me or throw me in prison. My life's not worth much, but my family. I only wanted to give my wife and son a better life. I mean, you, you might have wanted to give your life and son a better life, but you've done it the really wrong way. Hubert's first love is gold. You must have some squirreled away. I'll tuck some coin away for the future. But if it buys me a future out of prison, Hubert can have it. I mean, you're kind of lucky if you oh, don't get shoved in prison. This is Lily of the Coterie. Given the importance of stopping the cargo robberies, I have enlisted a consultant. Consultant? Sure. Whatever helps you sleep at night. Well, <laughs> she's she's totally going to want to murder now? someone, isn't she? There's an ambush planned tonight at Dietrich Crossing. Tonight? That leaves you barely enough time to intercept them. You had best leave immediately. We'll protect your precious shipment, but make sure you have the coterie's payment. Want me to deal with this runt? Free of charge. I'll drop him in a ditch on our way out. Yes, take him. With my blessing. I assume my partner will not object. Uh Huh. Sabine will pay you back if you let him go. Oh, really? I'm more inclined to beat the coin out of this sheep swallow and then kill him. He's nothing, you bear. Take his offer and cut him loose so we can get back to business. Fine. Get me your ill-gotten coin before I change my mind. Oh, thank you, Miss Hayes. I know I don't deserve it. But thank you. We're wasting time. You genuinely don't deserve it. You're lucky I don't just let him kill you. I, my hawk would be a huge mess of grief right now, so... I, I think I'm being a bit nice on the guy by letting him pay it back. I mean... He has a job. I don't know why he feels the need to screw over... Uh, screw it all up by trying to... I don't even know what his plan is. But we'll make the rotters pay. I don't trust you. We're too late for your boys. I'll cut you a friend. You've got to request. See how that many I'll take. I think this will go all right. I hope this will go all right. <laughs> I do love that effect. That's quite cool. Ooh, I did some good damage. Oh, gotta take out that archer, right? You, you, my pretty. Uh, oh yes, pinning shot. Now stop. You want it? Oh, that's Isabella doing some very good work there. That was almost too easy. Wait, I recognize that lout. Who is he? 
He's in the coterie. One of that damned fool Brecker's men. So your organization is behind this? We got explicit orders not to. Hubert's been good on his payments. If Brecker ordered this, the rest of his life will be very short and painful. Tell me about this man. He operates out of the south side. Always had more balls than sense. His <laughs> name is Boyle. Brecker must be involved. Let's pay Brecker a social call. We've got a lot to talk about. I've got to be sure first. I know who to lean on to get answers. Find me in the Undercity. Well, that's fine. I can live with a bit of a uh, bit of revenge and cold-blooded murder. Now, what else is there in this area? Anything? I mean, this is... Okay, they dress up as a different location, but we know we've been here at least twice, if not more. Ooh. I don't know what that was, but it's, it sounds good, doesn't it? Uh, nope, nothing up there. Nothing over here. And then straight to the Undercity, I suspect. Nah. Oh. Is it not going to let me go that far for oh no it's blocked off that whole area i can't explore it oh it's so annoying when it does that i don't even know why i don't like it that much i just don't i guess technically we're on sundermount then uh, no we're not doing that but we will go and do inside job and hopefully we will figure out uh, some more of these assassin folks i completely Forgot to check the inventory and see what I just looted as well. On the plus side, everybody lived quite easily through that encounter. It's weird difficulty spikes in this game. Uh, Zeb and Kek, eh, possibly not that hard. Maybe just a weirdly balanced group that I took with. But then it was quite like that. Not hard at all. I don't think anybody even got close to going down. Or if they did, I sure didn't notice it. Have I been here at night? Or have I just been here during the day? Nope, still can't do anything with you. Does this even have a day-night cycle? I guess technically it must. Mm, there's nothing down there. Oh well. So if I go up here. Alright, this is where you'd go to go to Anders' place. Oh no, I've already been here, that's not that's not shiny. Fair enough. Let's carry on. Ooh. Oh, Lily. We almost liked you. Don't let them get away. You coterie. One of Lily's friends. Lily was one of ours. She was working for you, and now she's dead. You You're almost exactly the same character. Did you more. kill her? Stop and think about it. We're being played. Explain yourself. This is a case of the right hand not knowing what the left is doing. One of the scum that attacked my caravans worked for someone in the coterie named Brecker. Lily said she'd look into it. I think Brecker had her killed. Brecker? Hmm. If you're lying, I'll find you. Men, we have to get to the bottom of this. Now. I suppose at least the, the um, coterie are self-fulfilling. No, that's the wrong way to put it. Uh, they police themselves rather well. I suppose if you're dealing with... Um, so... Turn up your purses, Gertwall. The leases of Javaris Tintop are up for grab. It's another face that's extraordinarily similar. Your mother. I'm so sorry. I can't believe any 
There we go. Yeah, I think it's the hair. The hair makes everybody look the same after a while, doesn't it? I would say they improved that in Inquisition, but we all know that's a lie, don't we? All the faces do look very, very similar. Okay, let's put... Speed. And let's call up the dog. Hmm. Just, you know, like, actually attack some. Oh, no, she's about to sell fob traps. Oh, no, she's not. Right, if I can get here... Get trapped. There we go. No, it didn't last long, did they? We're keeping score, right? <laughs> uh, Alright. I honestly can't remember what we get out of this one. I'm sure we'll get something, but I'm not sure what. Oh no, look, he's hidden. Coward. I say coward, but he did go down really fast. Did I run all the way up here for that? Weird. <laughs> ah, yeah, he didn't do well to be. I think I did trip a trap actually, so that makes me feel sad. And maybe I didn't, it's hard to sell. Ooh, Rune of Spirit. Now that's not bad. Spirit damage is usually pretty darn good because it's very hard to armor against spirit damage uh, and protect yourself from it. So it can usually cut through most defenses. Is this going to be Brecker? Are we going to have a big uh, speech? Yes, yes we are. You must be Brecker. And you're that lice-covered refugee. Hope you enjoyed saying that. Those are the last words you'll ever speak. <laughs> Ooh, that might work. Oh look, he did, he did not take long to go down now. I know there's people up there, there's somebody up there doing some very nasty things. Oh, Isabella's injured, she did go down at some point. Oh look, Isabella's down again, whoopsie. Take that to keep me going at least. Oh. That's definitely missed. Well, at least we didn't need to worry too much about Isabella going down. Right, so we've got the rune for spirit. Uh, so that's quite good. I wonder if he had any, any good loot on his body. Baron War Boots. I suspect. Yeah, I can get into that. Hmm. I think the biggest prize is probably the uh, the rune. Actually, let's have a quick look.
Good lord, Isabella. How many times have you gone down? Three. That's, impre oh, that's impressive. All right, let's uh, let's carry on. Uh, anything new to do? Oh, back to oh yes, back to Hubert to report that we took care of the problem. I wonder if it'll let us go back into the bone pit now, or if it's just sealed off as foreshadowing for the Act Three big ass mature dragon. I think it's sealed off for the uh, foreshadowing because I think that might be the only thing we've got to do. I found the thieves responsible for the cargo thefts. I put them out of business. Excellent. With that resolve, the mine's profits will soar. For now, partner, please be sure to visit our workers occasionally. You have a knack for keeping them happy. You mean I have a knack for, you know, not not being completely derogatory to them? Because that's probably what he means. Okay, I'm going to do the long and boring troll around and see if I can't figure out uh, if there are any more of these assassins I have to sketch about. Ooh, that's not the attack I expected, but I will take it. Dog lords. Is it just because I haven't been down here in a while, maybe? Oh well, I mean, I'll take the random combat even though I wasn't expecting it. I was rather hoping to tempt out some more of um, Sketch's assassins. Sent him in the area, and Varg wants to say something to me anyway. Let's pop him to the uh, hanged man. Ah, Waxler. Oh, I think I've got your hat. Make her eyes wish whoever was telling this. This fell into my hand. You recognize it? Not forgotten by that. Oh, hello, Varric. And then Hawk tore the door clean off its hinges, walked into the room, and. <clears throat> I guess we'll finish this later. Have you got a minute, Varric? For you, I have all the time in the world. Actually, I've been meaning to talk to you. I hear you and the Ravani have something going. So, what's going on, Hawk? Well, well, well. I never thought you were the type, Varric. I'm flattered. It's the chest hair, isn't it? Women can never resist my chest hair. Unfortunately, it's not to be. I'm spoken. Uh, Bianca stands in my way again, does she? 
What can I say? She's the jealous type. Listen, as your friend, I feel like I'd be doing you a disservice if I didn't say something. Isabella is a great girl, but I think you're likely to get hurt. By which I mean stabbed and left for dead. In all the time you've known me, have I ever given you the impression that I was turned off by crazy? <laughs> okay, point taken. <laughs> well, that's, that's a weird conversation. I, I think I'd completely forgotten we had that. Bless him. Just for that, let's order a drink. Wow, we're in town after all. Okay. Uh, who else wanted to speak with us? Oh, Adeline, and we've got her shield actually as well. So, uh, no, no, yes. I've got a present for you. I'm not sure which one will trigger first. Hawk. I don't care what else is going on. We haven't spoken about Leandra. How are you? I have a smile on my face. That should be enough for most people. That doesn't work on me. I knew her too. I want to think my mother was like her. I just have flashes of impossibly long hair. But my father... Would you like to hear one thing? What is it about death that brings out the speeches? Maybe people think it's something they can share. That's the human response anyway. I'm not sure what you're doing. Don't lose your friends too, Hawk. Oh, that's going to be grumpy, Aveline. I mean, it's a bit rude. I'm grieving. I have something for you. Do you now? A shield? Oh, and... Born by the one true Sir Aveline. Lovely. Thank you. See? This is why I never get you anything. I had a shield. It belonged to Wesley. It was difficult to let it go, but I did so. Utility over sentiment, right? We sold it, didn't we? And here Actually, I I no we didn't. Hurt. It's in my stash. If you didn't think this would upset me... What was your intent? It's not enough to want you to be happy. Happy is for fools. Okay, it's not the shield, is it? No, and it's not Wesley. You've got me doing a lot of things. Some I don't agree with. Some I'm surprised I do. I'm not sure where I'm going as it is. Replacing what I was with this. I mean, who is Sarah Aveline to me? I thought of you when I found it. Maybe that was foolish. I can appreciate that. Then accept it on those merits. Nothing more. It is... a fine shield. You do know that Orlesian Smith slapped Sir Aveline's name on every second piece of armor. This didn't really belong to her. It does now. <laughs> that's, a, that's a nice line. Charming. I like it. All right, uh, where are we at with the quests? Let's have a look at our journal. Still don't search Kirk Walker more Assassin's Hunting Sketch. Honestly, that sounds tedious. I think I've been to a bunch of places. Um, I mean, I could do Chateau Hain. Because we're getting close to the end of the uh, 
second act, and I did say I was going to do one of these, not that, but one of these in the second act. This is a real, real good place to end it. Um, I'm probably going to have to think carefully about who I'm going to take on my team and uh, do a bunch of uh, leveling up and stuff and rearmoring and reordering, getting all my gear off screen. But do you know what we're going to start tomorrow? It's going to be... Uh, I, I've already forgotten what the what the one is called, but it's it's the one in it's, it's the Orlesian one that isn't that doesn't involve Darkspawn, but does involve plenty of Orlesians, including I think I won't say it's a good stealth section because this game is not designed for stealth, but it has an attempt at a stealth section, and it's funny. Mark of the Assassin coming up. Mm, yes, we'll start that tomorrow. So. I do hope you've enjoyed watching as much as I've enjoyed playing as ever, uh, and I will, I will see you next time for the start of the first of the Dragon Age 2 DLCs, uh, Mark of the Assassin. Thanks for watching, guys. Okay, so I just checked what on the wiki um, about where this last boss location is for this group of assassins, and apparently, in the Hanged Man, at night, is a group. So let's see if we can't uh, persuade them to come and join us and attack us. Also, apparently I haven't... Yes, here they are. Excellent. Right. Can we bait them towards us? Possibly not. Ooh, yeah, I don't have my normal group with me. That's not great. Actually, I don't know how I just wasted that on. Oh, is that it? Ah. Quest updated, right? I think that was the last of the groups that we needed to worry about. So, uh, down to the docks, I believe, to hand that in, uh, and then, then we'll be ready. So, uh, let's nip down there. Let's just very quickly check all these rooms. Oh. I removed another bunch of leather. Good on you, Sir Rahawk. We friends are indeed friends of yours. Another time, friend Hawk. Many of them, hopefully. Do you know what else it turns out I completely forgot about? Actually getting the monetary reward for um Yeah, getting the monetary reward for clearing out the clearing out the guys. I forgot I could do that. I think I'm kind of an idiot. Oh well. Do uh, you have anything useful? No. Alright. Let's nip down to the docks, tell Sketch that we've cleared all those guys. And then I think we get the reward from... From them. From the... Uh, do we get the reward automatically? Well, we're about to find out. I'm not sure it ever would have occurred to me to come up to, come up to the Hanged Man at night. Which is a failing on my part. Also, apparently they're not going to tell me. I'm sure it's docks at night to tell Sketchy safe. How could anyone possibly forget to spend all their points? Nope, you're about to tell me that the dogs are charging. Fair enough. Still not them then. However, here is 
sketch. Bless him. The screaming mage. You have a lot of enemies. More than I knew. My reputation precludes me. Take my advice, friend. Stay away from storytellers. Never know what they'll say. Excellent. Is that just going to hang over your head forever? Oh. Oh, game. You do like to be broken occasionally. Well, we got his reward, which I'm pretty sure is a staff. But uh, that was that was all I wanted to show. Uh, and finally completing it off the impact. If it's, is it off my journal? It is, because now we've just got... Yeah, yeah, we'll save that. Yes, definitely doing Mark of the Assassin next time. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys. Ta-ta for now.